Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel, Luma Moon Tarot. So everybody, I am here um, doing a random collective reading for you, okay? This reading is not going to be for all of you. I feel like I'm picking up on what's going on with the Divine Masculine though. Um, but anyway, uh, you can be any sign for collective readings, right? If something pulled you in from the title, there's something in it for you, but just don't try to force anything, okay? Um, it's not going to be for all of you. And thank you so much, everyone, for all of your support, the likes, subscribes. Um, thank you, thank you so, so much for joining the Soul Tribe and all everybody new here. All of my supporters out here, thank you so much. I appreciate you guys. Oh boy, yeah, they chose the devil. As soon as the devil came out, I, you know, it's like they, they, they made their bed and the divine is making them lie in it. Okay, so yeah, they're out in the cold. They're out in the cold because they pushed away. I feel like this is the messages that they got from people. They pushed things away. They, um, this person was out there choosing other people. Um, I feel like they may have found somebody else, too, that instead of coming towards the feminine, this person found somebody new, a Queen of Wands energy. They've been, you know what, yeah, they've been being told here that this person was supposed to do the right thing. They've been getting messages, we all had time to do the right thing and make the right choices. And this person, they continuously... Um, push away all of the messages that the divine is giving them and they keep choosing toxic people and toxic situations and I feel like this person they found somebody new here with the queen of wands energy and I feel like they jumped right back into another toxic situation I really do I really do their life is just falling apart man and they keep choosing toxic people and uh, the divine, this is the divine just saying, you know what, we have to bring an end to this. It's the end to a cycle. If you don't want to, you know, if you continuously um, fight against all that the divine wants you to do, you know, if you're getting the messages, but you continue to ignore. If you um, pray for help, right, but you continue to push it away, right? Um, if you keep choosing toxic people and karmic individuals, man, you know what? Um, you can stay with the devil. That's what this. That's what the divine is saying. We get, we got to put an end to this. This is the world card. Uh, end to a cycle, right? And a beginning to a new one. And this person, you know what? They're over here now, getting their karma. And the here's here's the thing. When the fight begins with himself, that's what this says when the fight begins with himself. So you know what? The divine has left this person to their own devices. Okay? If they keep choosing the devil in toxic situations, that is where they'll stay then. That's what the divine is. I feel like that's what they're saying here. Okay? And this is truly when the fight begins with themselves right? Or himself. That's what it says. When the fight begins begins with himself, that's what this is. Now they have to carry their own burdens and, and get their own help from the devil, which isn't going to happen. You know, now they have to, they're, they're being left behind, I guess. You know, there's a, there was a portal, right? There was a portal. That's a door, right? Um, and your person was supposed to pass through it, and they didn't pass. They didn't pass through it. They didn't pass a test. They didn't learn the lesson. They didn't want to take a look at this. They kept choosing the devil. All right. And so, yeah, um, that's it. They get to keep the devil then. They get to keep the toxic people. They get to, they get to stay in the situations they made. Yeah. You know, now this person may be thinking, oh, wait, I made a mistake, right? I feel like someday that's how they're going to be. But, they're, you know, in hangman position, the, that light bulb will eventually go on, okay? Um, they'll eventually get it. But by the time they, by the time they want to come back in for, uh, to reunite with their feminine here, the feminine's going to be gone, having a victory in life and able to move forward and being happy, 
okay? Because you know what? This divine feminine, I feel, has learned their lessons. You could be dealing with the Pisces. You could even be dealing with the Cancer. But by the time they're they're able to, to come towards the feminine, at least this person, to reunite, you're going to be all, already be gone. That's how I'm feeling here. I feel like you're the warrior in this divine feminine. You're the true warrior here. And uh, this person, I feel like they've got a lot of learning to do. You're leaving them behind here. So is the divine. They're being left to the devil to fight their, you know, to fight this situation on their own. I feel like this person is um, losing protection, divine protection. Um, yeah, they're they're gonna have to. This is them fighting. They're fighting with themselves. The fight begins with himself. That's what it is. The fight is now beginning with himself. That's it. You know, I feel like the divine is sick of being ignored, having all of their messages completely ignored. This person has fought against the divine. Okay, and now they got it. They're on their own. That's what this is. That's um, that's the divine saying and you're on your own. We have to close out this cycle now. Oh, man. Yep. They may want to apologize here to a Queen of Cups energy that this person is in love with. But they, I feel like they've waited too long. You may not feel the same way about them. You could totally be a Cancer, maybe Pisces, Scorpio. Yeah, this person, they could be a Sagittarius, Pisces, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, Capricorn, Aquarius. <clears throat> yeah, I feel like you don't um, feel the same way about them anymore. It's just been too long. This is something that could have gone on for um, three to three months, three weeks, three years or more. I feel like this person treated you like an option, but now the illusions are coming down. See, the illusions are starting to come down and this person is realizing they're in love with you. You're focused more on your spirituality. You're listening to the messages that you're getting from the divine. Extremely intuitive and being led forward because you did your work. They may be all up in their emotions here, but this person is still noncommittal. They still uh, have in and out energy, just want to play around. They, li they like things that are sexy, maybe flashy, you know. I feel like they turned down love. They, they fought against the messages. They fought against what they knew they were going to, you know, what they had to do. And now the divine has left them to the devil. They're praying now, I feel. They're praying for you, making a wish perhaps but um yeah they're not hearing anything the divine's like no, i'm sorry we're not helping you anymore you have to get yourself out of this you have to you have to change your toxic ways you've got to stop um going after toxic people and toxic things we've already tried and you've run out of time and now we have to we really have to uh close this cycle out you know, the fight is now, uh, they're on their own. They're on their own. Wow. Yeah. I, I feel like, you know, if the divine does help them, they're going to uh, bring down a tower for this person. They're going to level everything in their life. I feel like they've already been getting their karma. This person's had so many other options, and they keep choosing, um, I feel, toxic, karmic people. You know, meanwhile, there's a star, a light worker, a divine feminine over here um, that they, I feel, they owe an apology. Okay, so how is this masculine feeling? How are they feeling? 
very vulnerable. Yeah, because they're unprotected. What did I just say? It says so right there. Defenseless, unprotected, helpless. That is how they feel. They chose the devil over and over and over and over and over again and ignored the divine. So the divine is like, well, all right, then we got to close the cycle. You're unprotected. Yes, and the tower comes down. Everything kind of falls apart. Yes, I'm telling you. <laughs> They're in a lot of grief, man. I feel like this person is scared, I got to say, or they're going to be. Because they're curled up in a little ball someplace in the fetal position, crying. Yeah, because look, <laughs> God is angry. Because God is angry. Spirit's not dealing with this. Look at all of the towers that they're having here, all the lightning bolts. I'm telling you, they, they knew what they were supposed to be doing here. Okay, they knew they needed to make a life change. They knew they needed to get out of toxic situations and away from toxic people, okay? And they knew they needed to give you an apology, and they didn't. They didn't want to do it. They didn't do it. So, yeah, they feel very vulnerable, very, I feel like they're scared. They know they're getting their karma because of how, as soon as I said that, afraid. What did I say? They're scared, fearful, scared, terrified. I'm telling you, they know what they're um, what they're going to be suffering now, you know, and they're guilty. They know they were supposed to do make right what they did to this um, divine feminine and they didn't. The divine told them over and over and over again, gave them ample time to do it, and they still fought against it. So guess what? This person's on their own. They're going to have to, yeah, the divine has closed the door on this. They chose the devil over and over and over again over, over the divine. And they get the devil. And this is, this is about, this is what's about to happen. Tower moments. Oh my gosh. They're completely unprotected. This is everything that I said in the reading. It's all confirmed right here. Wow. Let's get your advice, okay? What advice do we, because honestly, I feel like, um, I feel like you're moving forward, all right? You're having the victory because you put in the work, collective, okay? You did what you were asked to do. Even though it was hard, this person didn't want to put forth any effort. They just wanted to chase after whoever. Treasure Island, you're about to get, I feel, new love, money, abundance, whatever you've been wishing for, it's about to be granted. Okay? And I feel like this person, they may have to watch this happening for you. Um, yeah. Yeah. But you have things that are fated for you, blessings that have been stored for you, okay, in higher realms. And I feel like you have made it through um, all of this with flying colors, learned all your lessons, passed all your tests. It's graduation day. Those doors to the vault of your blessings that are being stored for you, that those doors are opening now. Um, because we're in a new cycle, so a new portal is opening now. And I feel like now those those faded things for you, the blessings, they're all about to come. You're going, about to be showered with blessings here. A whole new life. I'm hearing a whole new world. Yeah. Yeah. From Aladdin. Yeah, you're, you're held in high regard here on a pedestal. Okay. I feel like you've been going through some major changes here, um, a big transformation, okay? Maybe even, I feel like they've been working on you, like giving you heightened abilities and heightened senses, okay? You may, um, something about the fabric here, you may not like certain fabrics that you may start noticing that you have a sensitivity to fabrics. I've picked that up for the last few weeks. 
Um, so yeah, and it's happening to me too, by the way. <laughs> it is. Um, yeah, there's a lot of my old sweaters that I loved that I can't wear anymore because I find them too itchy. So I got to get rid of them. You know, it, as soft as they were before, they're not like now. It's got to be things like natural materials and silks and really soft things, you know. So you may notice that too. That's just, I don't know, something that I've noticed about myself recently. Um, but yeah, and I feel like um, you're, you're about to be blessed. You know why? Because you followed your divine path because you listen to the divine and you let them lead you, okay? You let them carry you through this. You had faith, you listened. This person didn't listen. So now the divine is leaving them to the devil and, and I feel like the devil is ripping their world apart. And they're on their own with this. They're on their own. So collective, I feel for you, you're about to be blessed. You're about to be getting major blessings because you pass all your tests and you learned and you did what the divine wanted you to do. So for that, you're held in very high regard and just keep allowing the divine to lead you, you know, just keep listening and allowing the divine to lead you and be grateful, right? Um, yeah, anyway, collective, that's what I've got for this reading. I do hope this helps. I hope it resonates. If you guys like this video, please hit that like button, right? Subscribe to my channel if you like this vibe. And until next time, everyone, take care of you and peace out.